we all know that spending gold in game is essential for improving our character. But what if I told you that there is more efficient way to do it? Today I will be sharing some game changing tips on how to get the most bang for your buck when it comes to spending gold. Let's kick off with gear modification. Crafting your own coating is usually the most effective option. But if that is not viable, don't rush to the trade just yet. Instead of buying the coating directly, why not consider investing in those inexpensive purple gear priced as cheap as 1000 gold each. By dismantling them, you not only get 3 to 32 coating depending on what gear you dismantle, but you also earn silver in the process. Here I have summarized the total number of coatings you will get from each type of gears you dismantle. Take for instance, if you are aiming for single purpose stat which require 500 coatings, you will need to dismantle 32 main weapons which will cost you only 32,000 gold if you manage to find 1,000 gold for each main weapon. And don't forget that 76,000 silver coin that you'll be getting for free. Now that is what I call a win-win situation. Applying the same principle to gear purchase can also be a game changer. Take this AK-15 for example, boasting an impressive stat value at 70,000 gold coin. Instead of directly buying it, why not check out the AK-47 with the similar stat, as it sells for way cheaper due to oversupply. Then by using the transfer function to move those stat to the cheapest AK-15, saving you a cool 47,000 gold. The real saving kicks in when you are eyeing for gold guns with purple stat. While many gold guns with this stat can cost millions, you can snack the cheapest gold gun and a purple stat purple gun for a combo of just 300,000 gold, saving you 50,000 gold for this SVD sniper rifle. Heck, it even works for gold to gold guns. Take for example this origin shotgun which cost 1.2 million gold for 2 purple stat. You can buy a cheaper gun with 2 purple stat. For this example is AK-47 for 700,000 gold and the cheapest shotgun which cost 200,000 gold, saving you 300,000 gold. I know the example shown is not exactly the same stat, but I hope you know what I'm trying to convey here. So, I hope you find this goal saving strategy helpful for your next in-game shopping spree. Since you are here with me till now, I'm going to tell you that this strategy works best when new homestead level is released. As there will be an oversupply of gears as everyone is crafting for the new gear and you can easily get those gear for a cheaper price. If you are curious about how I earn using this method, drop a comment below and perhaps in future I will create a separate video on that. Until then, I will see you on the next video. Bye bye.